Hey YouTube, um, this is an update video on the Ruger SR 1911. Uh, we've been shooting it and uh, testing it for a while now, using it in some competition, um, and it's been great. Um, it's put about 2,000 rounds through it to this day. Um, at the beginning, I had a couple jams. Um, that's just break-in period, which is normal. Um, but other than that, it's fed everything reliably. Uh, I've shot really good ammo, I've shot crappy ammo through it, I've shot hot ammo, we've shot light ammo through it, um, we've even shot some hollow points, and everything works great. Um, actually, now that I think about it, I think the only jam um, we had was we shot a bullet that we kind of thought about that wasn't going to do so good, I think it was kind of pushed in maybe a hair, or there was something wrong with the casing, I don't remember, and it jammed. I think that was like the only problem that we've ever had besides break-in. Um, I've ran different magazines through it. Like, I just recently bought this uh, Chip McCormick 10-rounder, uh, and it's doing pretty good. Um, I wouldn't say it's as nice as the factory magazines, but um, definitely nice. Uh, Ruger just came out with some factory 10-round uh, magazines, so I may pick up a couple of those. Because it's just kind of nice to have um, in competition for two extra rounds. Um, the gun has been great. Um, I couldn't ask any more out of it. The only thing we've had problems with is... Um, so at the beginning, when we bought it, the uh, grip safety was a little bit loose. And um, so we decided to look into it a little more later because it wasn't that big of a deal... It started to get a little more and more loose after a while, and um, so we decided to have our gunsmith look at it. It had a little bit of side-to-side -side wiggle, and we just weren't too happy how wiggly it was, which is not supposed to be how they... It's not how they're supposed to be. That's what even Ruger said. Um, we've... So we talked to Ruger, our gunsmith did, and he's going to send us a replacement part for it, Um which was no big deal at all. We got it for free and everything. Ruger's great uh, customer service. Um, but we didn't send the gun in. We'd rather have our gunsmith do it just so we didn't have to ship the gun out because it's kind of a pain. Um, so we got that fixed, and now it's how it's supposed to be, and it's very nice. The gunsmith did a great job, um, fit it very well. The other thing he had to do, which we still can't figure out if it was our fault or not, but the uh, thumb safety had a small chip and uh, I remember when we were cleaning it and just chipped off, and we didn't drop it or anything. And um, so it wasn't that big of a deal. The gunsmith took a look at it. He said the part was a little thin there, or there was something wrong with that um, steel when they used it or something like that. And so he just replaced that. And uh, we also got that part from Ruger, and now it's the same length as it should be and smoothed out, and now I will not cut my hand anymore on that sharp uh grip safety I don't know I actually I'd probably blame that on me because I don't know if I hit it or not because I just noticed it and I know it didn't come like that um quality so far um it's it's held up it's a great gun I've shot a lot of different types of 1911s some that are really expensive and this is my this I shoot this one the best I've shot um three thousand dollar um gu guns from Nighthawk Custom before and I can shoot the same group with this gun as I can with those. And this gun's 700 bucks, So, um, it's done great. Uh, that's the update I have for you guys. Um, I may do another one. Maybe after, when it hits 4,000 rounds, I don't know. Or maybe three. Um, I'm gonna keep shooting it. It's my competition gun, so I'm just gonna keep using it. Um, so yeah, thanks for watching. Um, Check out my channel for some other videos. Um, keep looking out for more updates on the Ruger. I'm still putting it through its paces uh, since it is a new gun by Ruger. Um, and thanks for watching as always. Um, please rate, comment, subscribe to me if you'd like. Uh, thank you for watching.